Oh, look at that. That's a terrific plant. For the past 30 years, David Goldstick has been putting his green thumb to good use in Riverside Park for hours each week. Work is never done. It's the spot where Goldstick's kids used to play, unaware of the Holocaust Memorial nearby. Then in 1991, when plans were made to petition for funding to restore the memorial and the surrounding area, Goldstick offered to help, but he wanted to garden the area himself. I did such a good job that Parks Department was delighted when I suggested I try to landscape the area between um, 79th and 86th Street. From five flower beds to four acres, Goldstick says he is proud of what he's accomplished. He estimates he's planted over 10,000 plants, propagating his own buds in a small nursery near the garden. Everything you see here was put in by me. What's the best part? Be able to look at it every day and say, this is what you did with your life. That's the best part. Now he's in his 90s. Goldstick says he will never stop gardening. He's grateful for the volunteers who help out knowing that he couldn't do it all on his own. This master gardener hopes people will finally take a second to stop and enjoy the beauty around them as they race along the path. I tell you, it's a life's work. It really was made the life worthwhile. It's, un it's unbelievable. For growing a space every New Yorker can enjoy, David Goldstick is our New Yorker of the Week. Pat Kernan, New York One.